Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a Target and Kohl's try on haul. I also have an Old Navy haul coming. I just feel like all the stores are coming out with all their new fall stuff. It's like full swing now that it's September and I've been finding a ton of good pieces. So I wanted to do a combined one because I feel like each store didn't really quite have enough for its own separate haul. I don't know, maybe there's a lot of stuff in this haul. So I wanna jump right in, all my sizing, all the links will be down below as always. I did do a different setup because of course it's raining again. Like every time I pull the camera out to film, it starts pouring and it gets like really gloomy outside. So the lighting's terrible and whatnot. But um, if you see any of this mess going on over here, it's just because I like shoved furniture out of the way so that I could put my mirror here and hopefully get good lighting from this wonderful window without further ado let's hop right in first item I want to share with you guys is from Target it's this poncho it's a one size fits most um, size so one of those things that just kind of fits everyone differently the thing that attracted me to it is how soft this is I'm like super sensitive with my sweaters and stuff and very picky about the way things feel and I can actually wear this with just my bra underneath if I want to I put a long sleeve on underneath it because it's actually quite chilly today um, but I loved the color of this I loved how it felt and it's just really cute and quite simple but I like the slits in the side um, it does connect here though so it like stays on I generally don't gravitate towards the ones that are like totally open here just being a mom of two then I just feel like it's all twisted and messed up within an hour so I love that and I just think this color is so pretty I have it paired with my Spanx leggings because this does cover my bum so I feel like most people could probably wear this with leggings but it would be really cute with jeans as well and then on bottom I just have these snake booties from Walmart which I mentioned in my last Walmart haul love these I felt like this was a really cute look just casual easy perfect for fall I love layering up with a poncho like this because it's just so easy but it looks stylish and it's comfortable too like it feels like pajamas so I may just have to put my mirror here permanently like I used to when I first started doing try on hauls um, because I just feel like the lighting is so much better but this next outfit is super comfy again I just have my Spanx leggings on and then this sweater from Knox Rose is new this is so soft and cozy guys this is definitely a keeper for me um this is about as colorful as i'll get i wear these colors along with olive green and that's it i think this would be really cute with some sneakers but i have it paired here with these booties i got these from kohl's but they're almost like a cloth um, material but they're really sturdy really well made they've got a zip so they're nice and convenient to put on they've got this cute chunky heel that i think is not too chunky so if you want to try out this trend but you don't want to go for like the full-blown platform ones these would be a really good option i do have these in a seven and i'm normally a size seven and a half and they're a little snug so i would say probably if they were seven and a half they'd be perfect but i just think these are so cute and they just kind of give like a cool vibe to any look um they also match like perfectly with this sweater so i just threw them on but very comfortable i absolutely love this sweater i have it in my true size extra small it's stretchy it's so soft and i have my sleeves rolled as well because they're like quite long but for any mamas out there who are pregnant this would be adorable with like a fitted tank underneath and then it's something that you don't have to like buy maternity but you can wear afterwards and whatnot so yeah i always loved wearing big cardigans like this when i was pregnant in the fall and winter and i would just wear like a fitted tank throw on some sneakers and a cardigan like this and it was really cute so next up guys if you follow me on instagram you probably have already seen this jacket a few times this is a new favorite of mine this is by wild fable and i got it in my true size extra small the quality of this guys is so good and it's like oversized without i always say that without being too boxy but i just think that's important because i know a lot of people feel like if they are wearing something that's kind of more boyfriend fit or something i know a lot of people have concerns about it making them look boxy or bigger than they are and that is not the case with this one in my opinion i just think it hangs really well and i love the acid wash of this one i just think it's perfect it's got a little bit of those warm tones in it that make it look like slightly dirty which i really really like it's got some really nice seam detailing on the side it's got pockets just so comfortable it doesn't quite cover my bum so I do generally wear like a longer um, t-shirt underneath but it's just really good I cannot recommend this jacket more same t-shirt underneath same Spanx and same boots on just an easy uh, look that I would wear throughout the week and just wear all the time this is something I would absolutely wear all the time okay next up another piece by wild fable i love this brand because i just feel like they're trendy and cool and their price point is really really good so i found this t-shirt it says wander free to get lost i actually didn't even read it until right now but i just thought this was really cute i like the color of it and this is an extra small so i love how actual like oversized it is you definitely just have to get your true size it's like tunic length so soft so nice and like lightweight this is really easy to like side tuck you can front tuck you can tie it um, but I have a couple jackets that I just wanted to throw on with it. I think it looks really cute with these boots 
and these leggings and I feel like just a little jacket over the top would be adorable. I love having tunic length um, t-shirts like this just in case I do have jackets I want to wear in the fall when I just want to wear like leggings and be comfy but the jacket doesn't like cover my bum. I'll throw on a little tunic t-shirt like this so my bum's covered and then the jacket will keep me cozy. So last time I checked this exact graphic was actually out of stock. Uh, but they have like five, six different prints in the same like t-shirt. So you'll get the same kind of feel and fit, I would assume, with a different graphic or different print on it. Okay, so I just threw on this Sherpa jacket, guys. This is so cozy. I got this in a size small because I wanted it a little bit more oversized. I could tell that it wasn't super um, oversized. It was kind of more just like true to size. So I did size up in it, and I think it's really cute. I'm glad that I did. I feel like the extra small just would have been... Um, I don't know like a little too fitted for my style. I just have it over this t-shirt I did kind of do like a side tuck um, with a t-shirt But it still scoops down and like covers my bum in the back since this jacket is a bit shorter But this jacket is really really good quality I can see in the viewfinder that you guys can probably tell like how soft it is and I love all this detailing I like the color combo. I believe they did have this in a couple different colors. Of course I went for the cream and the brown. That's just my aesthetic but uh, really really good jacket the inside is like this um, almost like a t-shirt fabric which I love and then the sleeves are more like a fleecy on the inside but very very cute something I feel like you could style a lot of different ways you get that Sherpa trend kind of feel uh, without having to wear like a big like poofy jacket so this next jacket is not as much my style as the last one this is like a true bomber jacket like the way it's fitted here at the bottom and then a bit like puffier throughout but it's really really comfortable this one actually came in a really pretty um like caramel tan color which i saw online but they only had the cream in stock and it's got this really nice kind of like subtle quilted detail on it i hope you guys can see that it is a bit hard to see but the fabric is really really soft and if you're looking for just kind of like a cool kind of different bomber style jacket this one's really good the quality feels great i got mine in a size extra small so i wonder if i would have liked this a little bit more in a small just because i feel like i don't know this just kind of feels like fitted even though it's not up here but i think i would just i don't know i just like it a little bit bigger but it buttons and zips up the front it doesn't have a hood or anything so just a cute little bomber jacket trendy comfortable and this is by universal thread so the quality is really good i find their stuff um always like washes and wears really well so that is this jacket a hands down another favorite from this haul guys this top is so cute so they have this in some solid colors and then they have it in i believe two plaids this one is like a smaller plaid it's got like i don't know like a burnt orange and black it's showing up a bit more red on the viewfinder it's actually showing up very red it's definitely more of a burnt orange i wouldn't call it red at all but the fabric is really nice and lightweight it's like a seersucker is that what it's called seersucker material this does not sound right but really nice material i love it this would be a great dress top for work tucked into slacks or a skirt anything like that it's so cute i love this bubble sleeve i got mine in a true size extra small i also love it just styled up with some ripped jeans like this and some booties it's just really cute kind of fall look um and a bit different than like your average plaid shirt it tucks in flawlessly like it's just super flattering and cute it's not like too bulky but i'll untuck it just so you guys can see kind of what that looks like a little bit of like a boxy fit absolutely love it highly highly recommend this top it's like trendy but still just like very comfortable something you want to throw on it's not too like over the top for every day in my opinion so yeah i absolutely love it okay jumping into the kohl's segment of this haul i wanted to share another dress top with you guys again i just have it paired casually with those same jeans same booties because i felt like this was just a really cute look for casual wear but this top would be so perfect to wear to work it's got this beautiful button detailing in the front which you can kind of like unbutton to your liking if you wanted to wear like a lace cami underneath you could button it down i just have the first button um undone to create a little bit of like a v-neck but this is like a really nice soft kind of silky material it hangs so well i love the color of this it's got a subtle bubble sleeve and this is just beautiful i'm definitely going to be keeping this I love it so, so much. I feel like it's so versatile. It's nice to wear like business casual, really versatile top that you can dress up, dress down, and the material just makes it feel and look really expensive and nice. This is a favorite out of the entire haul. I think everyone could benefit from a top like this and it's just oh, so good, guys. This is orange and pink. Never worn anything like this before. I don't know what got into me the day that I was shopping. Um, it might've been the lipstick I was wearing because I was wearing the same as I am today. Um, which is Mac Whirl, and I just felt like with my dark hair and the lips, I don't know, it's just kind of fun. So 
Of course, when I checked online, they didn't have this color combination. I'm determined to find it. They do have other colors in this if I cannot find this color, but it's super soft. I got it in my true size extra small. This is a flannel. It's not like a jacket, so it's a thinner material. It's definitely something you could kind of button up and tuck into something if you wanted to, but again, I just thought that this color was a little bit uh, different, and it does cover your bum too, so perfect with the leggings. I feel like you could get your normal size because um, it is a little bit oversized, but if you want it even bigger, just size up one. I feel like that would be kind of enough, but super soft, good quality. I felt like the fit was going to be really good. I could just tell and I was right. I really like the fit of it. So I know this color is not everyone's cup of tea. Again, I was just trying to kind of mix it up, try something different. I have it paired with just a tank underneath. Same jeans, same booties. Okay guys, so pastels are actually super in for this season and for winter. I'm seeing a lot of this like robin's egg blue, a lot of pastel purple. I'm kind of into it. It's like a fun way to kind of brighten up the darker seasons. I fell in love with this Levi's jacket. It's like this beautiful blue color and it's a corduroy fabric. It's super cozy on the inside. It's got like a Sherpa and then a silky lining um, inside the sleeve. I got mine in a size small, so I did size up one, but I actually really like the fit. I feel like it's really cute, kind of oversized, just a little bit like this. Uh, I feel like this is perfect. I would recommend sizing up if you want it to fit like this. I think the extra small would have been a bit fitted and just kind of, I don't know, a bit short for me, but of course it's Levi, so the fabric and the quality is really nice. The fit is good. It just feels good when you put it on. It hangs just right, and in case the blue is not for you, they do have more of like a rust color, like something like this. And then they also have it in a denim, which I wish I had purchased when I saw it in stock in my size because I feel like I would love the denim one and I would wear it a ton. I don't know. I'm kind of split between this blue color and um, the denim. But if you have blue eyes, I feel like this jacket would be so pretty. Like, I think this would be so pretty on my mom because her eyes are like literally this color with a touch of green. So anyway, I have hazel eyes. This color doesn't do a whole lot for me. It does bring out like my blonde hair, but... Yeah, stunning on someone with blue eyes, fun, different, good little trendy jacket for the fall and winter. Um, I definitely think you could layer it up too to keep it really cozy for the winter, but I just have it paired with those same jeans once again, and then my white scoop um, booties from Walmart, which I believe they only have these in black now. Um, I'm kind of wondering if they're going to bring the white back in stock, but um, I think any white booties would do. I okay, I feel like I'm sharing my last couple favorites for last, so definitely stay tuned for those, but... I have two dresses to show you guys. This one is like an adorable square neck midi dress. I did have to get it in a small. They didn't have an extra small. Um, so it is kind of like falling off my shoulder a bit here. And it's a little loose here as well. So I feel like you could get your true size. But this is so stinking cute. And the colors in it are really pretty. It's kind of got like a mustard background with some blue and pink um, and some cream. Really pretty neckline. I love this like quarter length sleeve and this little like puff detail. I apologize, it's so wrinkly. I never plan ahead enough to have time to steam them. I felt like this would be really cute for couples photos in the fall or family photos. I paired it with just some white boots for kind of a fun different look, but you could definitely do like tote booties and a little denim jacket or something. It's super duper flattering, like very flattering from the side. It's got a square neckline in the back as well and just really cute. It would actually be really cute for like pregnancy announcement too. Like if you're anywhere from like 12 to 20 weeks, I feel like this would be really, really cute just with like a little bump. Oh my gosh. But yeah, really good one for photos or just like a baby shower, anything that you have going on this fall. Okay, next up, another dress that needs to be steamed. Um, this is so cute though. I absolutely love the print. I actually bought two things in this print. It's like a really pretty kind of like tealish green background with these pink and bright red flowers on them. It's just so sweet. It looks like a really um, kind of like vintage floral print. So this part of it is like a faux wrap. It's actually connected over here with some cute little buttons. It's got the tie. Uh, but this is all like sewn this way. And then the bottom is like a wrap style. So this does like open up quite a bit. I feel like I am pulling the top in like this. I do wish it had a little snap. It needs one like right there, but that could easily be fixed with like a five minute little hand sewing tack there, or even just like a safety pin. I feel like you could totally hide it there. You could also just wear like a cute lacy tank or bra underneath it and it would be fine. I just really liked the sleeves and the, like the idea and style and print of the dress. I think it's really, really pretty. I have it on still with my white booties. Um, I don't know if I would really style it this way. It's cute, but maybe the taupe ones would be better. Okay guys, this is like my favorite top ever. I just feel like this describes so much about my style and it's so comfortable it's in this like stretchy um t-shirt material so you really don't feel like you're wearing a dressy top at all but this would be so cute for like a girl's night out or a date night i have mine really cinched up to show some like midriff just so you guys could kind of see like the detail of the top but 
Um, when I first tried it on, it actually like met my jeans, which I think is really cute too. Super flattering because it's like ruched in through here. Um, I love this little tie detail and it's fitted all the way around. I love the balloon sleeve. So cute guys. This highly, highly recommend if you're in the market for just like a little bit of a dressier top. This would also be really cute over um, like a simple dress, like a bodycon dress or something. You could really cinch it up. This would be so cute. Oh my gosh, with a bodycon dress underneath, like a fitted midi dress. Put this on if you're pregnant with a belly, cinch it right up so it's like up here and then just have your belly like right here. So stinking cute. Oh my gosh, I just love this top and it's in that same print that I really, really love. So you guys can see it a bit better here. The print does not look nearly as pretty in the viewfinder as it does in person. Like when I look at it in the viewfinder, it really doesn't do anything for me. But in person, I'm like, oh, this print is so good. It's so vintage and I just love it. On bottom, I have these adorable jeans. These are by Kohl's brand SO. And I really like their jeans. I've had multiple pairs of their jeans. And these are their high rise straight. I love that the bottoms have these like slits in them. I thought that was really cute. I am gonna have to order a size down though. So I got mine in a three. I'm normally a double zero 24. These are a 326. Um, I feel like I could do just fine with the 25 zero because like the waist is like a bit big here, but everything else fits so well. So I don't know if I, I don't think I would have to go down to the 24 because I feel like they would be just like too snug. I just feel like these look so expensive. They're super cute. They're very comfortable. They're different. I don't have anything like this in my closet. They're so flattering and fun. And yeah, I just think they're really, really good. So I also think these would be cute with like a chunky sweater or something on top just because they show like a little bit of your ankle and whatnot. So I don't know. I feel like you could really get away with something chunky on top but yeah guys that is the last look okay I almost forgot this backpack that I found at Target I actually was looking for the shoulder bag version which I since cannot find online so I'll try to link both of them for you guys down below but this is by a new day and I just thought this print was so beautiful and this actually fits my laptop perfectly so yesterday when I went over to a friend's house um, to have like a little meeting I had packed my laptop in here, a couple notebooks. It fit everything perfectly. That is absolutely it for today's haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for my Old Navy haul. It is humongous. So many good things. So many fun finds. So stay tuned for that. I hope you guys are all doing well. I love you so much. And I'm really trying to get to 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I know that's kind of super ambitious and most likely is not gonna happen, but if you guys could do anything to share, tell your friends, anybody who you think would enjoy my videos, I would appreciate it so, so much. And I love you guys, I hope you're all doing well and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.